Jordan Love, though. Jordan Love probably is, you said holding in. I said holding out, holding in um, for a new deal, a new, a new extension. Um, Green, Green Packers quarterback. Um, what's your thoughts on Jordan Love in the situation? Is he, is he worth extending a lot of money? Do you need to see more? Oh, I got to see a whole nother season before I, as a GM, ever give someone 40 plus million dollars. Because I wouldn't even give him a Daniel Jones contract right now. Yeah, mm. I get it's a two years, 80 million basically. But I don't even know if I give Jordan Love that. He struggled for the first half of the season before he got going. Maybe it was just the fluke part of that one, one little bit of his career was going to be great. But I would never give a guy like that few games that much money. Yeah, I'm with you too. I, look, I'm not saying he's not good enough. I'm not saying that he can be great. I got to see more. I'm with you. Like, yeah. We saw a tail of two quarterbacks last year. Now, granted, the team was banged up too. Also, receivers were out beginning of the year. Once they got healthy, of course, you know, things turned around. But at the same time, that happens. And you're the quarterback. You got to find, way, find ways to, to, to be better and, and, and find ways to win. Um, I just got to see more. Um, I mean, I don't even think he's a 50 million. Is, is he worth right now, based on what we know right now, is he worth $50 million a year right now? Based no. on what we have. I agree. He's not. However, that is the market right now for quarterbacks. We'll see. Um, is Jordan Love also a top ten quarterback to you right now in the league? No, I agree you as well too. Be top I agree. 10. Yeah, and so I want to say this so that so it doesn't sound like I'm hating on the guy, right? But you played maybe ten games where you excelled. Mm-hmm. If I commit to you at 50 mil for five years and you struggle, the team struggles for five years, the city struggles for five years. Now, we drafted you in the first round. Another team might have waited to the second round, the very start of the second round, like Carolina. And you could have played your first season out the gate there and yeah. sucked. And be out of the league now. So I get you're making 14 million and you want to make a lot more. Well, if you excel this coming up season, you're probably going to be the first quarterback to get 60 million a year. But I won't give you even 40 million until you played all of next season. Yeah. I, look, he's not there now based on what we have. But he's on the way. That's what I will say. He's on the way. If what we saw at the end of last year continues, and he, he even p- p- picks up, even if he sustains that, I would say, yeah, pay him. Why not? He, oh, yeah. Quarterbacks are Absolutely. But we got to see more of that before we commit to that. Because once you're paying the quarterback, that means we're not going to be able to pay receivers and other other, other ancillary pieces. We, you need to once once you're paying quarterback that kind of money, that means you can't pay anybody else. That simple. And, and, and that's the same situation the Cowboys have right now. With Dak Prescott, you know Dak Prescott, same thing. Now Dak Prescott, in his case, he's a lot older. Um, he's a top ten ish quarterback. I say he's top ten, but probably number ten, number nine. Um, but he's not. You, you're not going to get if you pay for Dak Prescott that kind of money now. You, you're paying that with, with knowing that you're not going to pay. You're know, get, going to get probably the best of him. His best years might may, may be ready behind him at this point. So, yeah, but I agree. Jordan Love needs to wait, and um, that's that. So anyway, 